Hello everybody, hope this finds you well. I'm uh, making this video to uh, try to give a help to a little friend, uh, a YouTube friend here. Uh, I won't give you the name because uh, I don't want to embarrass them, but they're not real computer adapt, you might say. And they wanted to know how to uh, make and upload a video. And what do I do? What do, what I do to do a video and make a video uh, and how I do it? So I'm gonna I'm just gonna kind of try to take you all through the steps. Of what I do when I I make a video to upload to YouTube when I'm just sitting here in front of my camera at home here. First, I you have to have a camera. You you, you probably know that already. It doesn't matter what kind of camera, as long as the program for the camera is on your computer and you can take what's on your device you use and and store and transfer it to your computer in a file somewhere. Me, I, I have a I have a small uh, little Microsoft camera that plugs right in the computer. It only has a little cord so it doesn't go very far so pretty much stuck right here with it. I uh, can't take it outside or nothing. A lot of people use their cell phones and stuff and you have to have the ability then to uh, download from your phone to your computer if you do that or any camera you probably have a thing to plug into it and software so let's just assume that you already have a camera and the software to run it and know how to use your camera because they're all different and I'm not going to go into the camera bit too much I'm going to do more of the how, how I edit it and then uh, upload it for you so uh, I'll try to See what I'm doing. Computer. Picture sucks. Okay, I'm going to film myself there. You get a funny image, don't you? Try to get your setting and everything. It doesn't really matter how you set up everything. That's, that's up to you how you want to, how fancy you want to get with it. I'm just me sitting here in front of my closet doing, doing this video. That's, that's just me. So, okay, get on to it. Now, I've recorded the video that you just see me making with my live cam. And now I'm going to go to my Windows Movie Maker. If you don't have a Windows Movie Maker, uh, you'll have to check out the, uh, read the directions for whatever movie editing system you have or software you have. My life cam itself has a software editing system in it but I prefer it using this form because the Windows Movie Maker turns it into a WMV Windows Movie Video which is takes up less space on my computer than uh, the AVI which the camera creates. Now I'm not going to go into the technical bits about that but I like to try to save space on my computer. Uh, now I go up here, you got a menu over here. I want to import a video. Well, you have to know where your, your software for your camera stores your videos. Now, mine puts it in pictures onto the live cam files automatically. You go in there be the last one I put would be the what I just was saying to y'all you'll see me there you know I always talk more than what you see I'll be doing things trying to get the camera set up and ready everything ready for you if the lighting and all got to put it in the put it down in the box you know, that point where I think it's about right start okay I look pretty enough right there up here and trim it at the beginning right there I always like to put a little monogram in front of it I made this little monogram thing when I got going into this YouTube I like to blend it into it and I'll put my title and stuff for the video here 
by going up here, Titles and Credits, Title on the Select Clip, and give your box what to put in there. There you are. Hello everybody, hope this finds you well. Now we don't need to bore you with all what you just heard. Up here to where I want to end it. I'm just me sitting here in front of my closet doing doing this video. That's that's just me. So let's get on to it. And I'll just cut that. All right. <laughs> now I'm going to add more parts to this. But once I've already edited and put everything in it, I want it. I'll then come over here to the computer, this computer, and it'll want to publish the movie and tell me where it's going to put it, and I'll title it, and I'll put it, and it'll publish it. I usually publish it to my desktop, that way I can find it easier. So now we're going to skip on up here. Okay, so now I've edited the video and published it in the movie maker. It will now be on the desktop. The next part is then how do I upload this video onto YouTube? We'll go into that now. Okay, now that we've uh, published our movie and we have it on our desktop, sitting there waiting for us, or whatever folder you saved it in, you now need to upload it to YouTube. Okay, to do that, click this upload button at the top of your page and take you to the upload page. Here's where you select a file or drag and drop a file. Pretty easy to drag and drop one. I got here. This isn't the same video that you'll be seeing in this tutorial, but uh, it would be kind of hard for me to upload a video I have not finished yet. This is part of it. Now, uh, so I'm going to upload a, another video I've been working on. It's kind of crude, but there it is. On there, it's already uploading, say. Now, what I like to do is make it public. Education, this, this is just the blog. Uh, people blogs, where is it going? You know, click the category. Save the change. Go up here to advanced settings. And I like to make my videos where people can remix them if they want. Right here you see standard YouTube license. Right here, Creative Commons. That means anybody can use it without having to ask me. You can go ahead and cut it up to what you want to with it. Be kind. If you use my stuff to attack me, I will come back at you if I find, find out about it. Um, and just let it, let it upload. It'll upload on its own. It'll show up on your. It'll tell you when it's done. And I'll tell you where it's going to be. And put your description in here. Put some tags in here. It helps to have a good tag. You see, it really is a simple process. You can overcomplicate it in your mind by thinking it's harder than it is. It's really not that hard. It might take some time practicing with your video editor and such to try to get your video the way you want it. And some people just go straight in and edit it right. They just download it straight to YouTube. You can do that too. Oftentimes you, you just take your image straight out of your from where your camera file saved it is and put it in there because YouTube does accept AVIs as well. And see after a while I'll empty out that page it has got all those AVIs in it because I've already done edited and published the movies that are in there in another form so then I can have that much space freed up on my computer so uh, it's just you know it uploads quicker YouTube works quicker with the WMV for some reason so I like that uh, format uh, because of that uh, it'll take you can upload directly from your cell phone you know look at the upload page and look at the Stuff written on an upload page, it, it, it's self-explanatory, pretty much. 
just keep it simple. Uh, I found that simple is best. Uh, and I hope you all could use this and it's helpful. Any questions, please ask. And uh, have a good day. Peace, love, and understanding will be with you all.